All right, what's up guys and happy new year. My name is Zach and today we're gonna to be talking about Rotary Life season two. So for those of you who don't know, I make a series on this channel called Rotary Life and it follows the build process of my 1985 Mazda RX-7. Currently it's getting a 1987 engine out of an FC that I bought for 850 bucks. And uh, it's away in storage right now for the winter, as you can see, oh, still pretty cold out there. So before I get into the actual changes to the format of the show, I wanted to throw out something. I have a, oh, it's upside down, a prototype Rotary Life um, sticker. And it's a six inch vinyl sticker. And I'm wondering if you guys are interested in purchasing one. I wanna keep the price low, probably around five or six dollars for a vinyl sticker and it just says Rotary Life established 2015 because it was established in 2015. And uh, I just wanna throw out if there's any general interest in buying a sticker so you can put it on your RX-7, RX-8 or really any car or toolbox um, just to kind of rep the show and uh, show that you're a fan. So other than that, the actual format of the show is gonna be relatively the same. I'm gonna make episodes and release them whenever I get done with them. It's not gonna be like a weekly thing or anything. Just whenever I'm done with it, I'm gonna release it because I want you guys to see it as soon as possible. Um, it is gonna be season two, so the episodes are gonna go back to episode one, two, three. That's just because I didn't want it to get to episode like 110 and someone new to the channel's like, well, there's no way I can jump in now. You know, like I don't, I don't want that to like scare people away from watching it, like episode, you know, 150 or something. I don't even know what I'd do by that. I'd probably blow up one and buy another one. Um, so yeah, it is gonna roll over. It's just gonna be season two, episode one, two, three, four, five. You get the picture. The other change is going to be uh, if you guys saw changing the slave and master cylinder on my friend's FC. During the video, I had little hints or little tips up on the screen. Um, I have a little action figure that has a rotor for a head, so I, I put little tips down at the bottom or up at the top or on the side or something that just say like Roto Man says, and it's like some tips because normally when I'm filming, I'm just I'm filming, 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 and I kind of forget little tips. And I know a lot of you guys uh, watch these videos. Uh, as inspiration or to help you do something on your RX-7 or RX-8. So I want to leave those helpful hints so those will be up on the screen. Other than that, the intro is going to change a little bit, just update it because I'm still on my old rims on the in the intro. Um, so just going to change that up a little bit. But otherwise, it's going to be the same show, same content, and we're going to continue the build from there. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you guys are ex as excited to continue the RX-7 build as I am. Let me know about the stickers if you are interested in buying one. Um, we can get some prices going on. I do make them myself, so we'll work out some prices. So take care, guys. Happy New Year, and I will see you soon. Take care.